Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're having a good day. So we're painting Elias, who's based off of Gandalf, as you can see, from Lord of the Rings. But this is for Massive Darkness 1, but been upgraded for Massive Darkness 2. He's been given a Zenithal Prime uh, of Mechanicus Standard Grey and a little bit of White Scar on top. And we're starting off with some Gwilliman Flesh. And we're doing his face, his hands. Now, I accidentally got his shirt there that's underneath his uh, robes, but that's not a big deal. I mean... You know, uh, Apothecary White is next for his beard, that wonderful gray beard and that pointy hat. Space Wolves Gray for pretty much the entirety of the rest of this miniature because this is going to be the fastest painted miniature probably I've ever done. Well, maybe not actually, but for Mass of Darkness 2, I think this is the one of the quickest ones. Uh, so please, it's only like a two minute long video. Please watch the whole thing. I mean, there's not much to say and it's great to hear my voice, isn't it, folks? And hit that like button if you're uh, liking these videos and hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel. Channel. So again, Space Wolves Gray is doing a great job on the cloak. And as you can see, the white scar is coming out a little bit brighter than that Mechanicus Standard Gray. So this is not your typical Zenithal highlight of black and white. This is gray and white because I didn't want a super uh, strong contrast between uh, the darks and the lights. Some Basilicanum Gray now to do his sword and his staff. I didn't want to do some metal on here too much. I just want a nice little stone looking sword. Well, you know, like a dull looking sword. Kind of simple. Rattling Grime now for his big belt. Uh, this wraps around the entire body, so just be careful there. Not to hit those pouches, but if you do, it's not a big deal. The other color will cover up. We're also going to be doing his boots with this Rattling Grime. This is a new contrast paint, by the way. And then we're doing some Cygore Brown on those uh, pouches that he's holding. So just to contrast a little bit of that. Um, the belt and the rest of his outfit because and there's these little cords there so just be careful with those. Uh, Drakenhof Nightshade just to add a little bit darker blue now to uh, his hat. Some fairy dust just on the, uh, the orb on his staff just to make it look like it's really shining instead of a varnish. Some tainted gold now for his belt buckle, uh, for the hilt of the sword and these little buckles that he has tying up his suit. Now I'm trying OSL, which is object source lighting, and I'm doing a dry brush of white, just like as if that scepter was shining on him. Anyways, there you go, folks. Elias the wizard is ready for the table and fast face the new demons in Massive Darkness 2. I want to thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.